have proof. Let's talk about the toxicity in the fandoms. And not to say all of these people are bad, but number one, because you are the biggest, we're gonna talk about the Philippines first. Be upset that your competitor isn't the favored amongst all the pageant commentators, amongst all the fans is ridiculous. No other country complains that way. No other contestants complain that way. And when you are behaving this way, in people's comment sections, in public, you not only embarrass yourself as a person, you embarrass your country. Now that I have done what I have done, you can go back and check and go check before people start deleting their comments because they're embarrassed as you should be. Go back and check the comments that have disgusting, mean, horrendous things spewed all over different comment sections that have a flag next to it. You are saying disgusting, mean, horrendous, racist comments I'm sorry to say, but that is just the reality of the world. People of color rarely ever receive justice. How long have we been demanding justice for and still there's no justice? How could there be peace? When there's no justice, how? I'm supposed to just be quiet while there's so much wrong in the world? No, I won't. And you shouldn't either. You shouldn't. It shouldn't have to be you for you to feel the pain of all that's going on. It shouldn't have to be you. Know that no one is born to hate. Hate is taught. Unlearn it. Unlearn it. Love is our essence. If you lost it, please find it. I know it's in there. If you peel off the skin, just take it off. You would never think that I was a person of color. You wouldn't. So so why why does this matter? Why? This is why does this matter? It, it's skin. It's like the clothes that you wear. Why does it matter? Why, why, why is my skin such a crime? I don't know whether to be upset, angry, hard. I, I don't know how to feel right now because I have a lot of emotions just running through my body. I don't know how to feel. There's pain, I can feel that, but I just, there's confusion because I, I don't know why we keep taking a step forward and like 10,000 steps back. I don't know why. And I'm naturally a problem solver. So I, it's really just eating away at me that I feel like there's not a lot that I can do. There's not a lot that I can do. And one thing I know for sure is that I can't do it alone. No one can do it alone. No one can. That's why it's so important for all of us to come together collectively. <sighs> collectively. Come together. The color of your skin should never be a crime. Your sexuality should never be a crime. Nothing about you should ever be a crime. Unless you commit a crime, then yes, justice must be served. But being you should never be a death sentence. It shouldn't. It shouldn't. 
I don't know. I'm really lost for words because this is really these times are I don't know. I'm really hoping for change. I'm really hoping that we figure it out. We have no choice. We have to figure this out. Whatever it is, figure it out. We have to figure it out.